it's Stephanie Gibson here with Brian Balzano, our 212 bodybuilding champion, Indie Pro. How do you feel right now? I'm on cloud nine right now. I lost my voice. I'm having fun. I can't believe this just happened right now. I know. He just punched the ticket to Olympia. So what does that mean for you? Are there any plans from now until Olympia that you have? Not really. The goal was the goal is either win or lose. If, if we win, we go to Olympia. If we lose, keep, like, I have more room to grow. Like, everyone's like, you can do another show. No, it's like, the show was to win. If I don't win, I, I weighed in at 207, so I still have room to grow. So it's like, if I don't win, why compete again? Just get bigger. I still have a weight limit to get to. So if I'm too small, I'm too small, but we won. So the goal is now just maybe relax for a little bit um, and then get ready for the Olympia. Yeah. Yeah, that's so excited. I'm so excited for you. All right, so I did hear a little bit of your background. Can you tell the audience what obstacles you had to overcome to get here? Long story short, uh, my first show was in May of 2014. I won the whole show. We went to USA's in Vegas so about eight weeks later. It was 78 days. I won my pro card. After that, I had to get shoulder surgery and I have six anchors in my right shoulder. I had to get ulnar nerve surgery, you can't see there. My arm started going numb. I had to get a bicep tendon surgery after that and three pyelonetal cyst surgeries. So after I went pro, it, I took six years off for medical injuries and then the seventh year I made my comeback at the 2021 Indy Pro. And so seven years from turning pro to my pro debut in one year from last year to now getting my Olympia ticket yes. and fourth show. My fifth show is going to be the world championship. I could not be much happier than that. I'm still learning. I'm still having fun and I'm still growing. Absolutely. What an incredible story. Like that is a true comeback story for sure. Like that's a very, I hope that inspires you all to just, you know, not give up because this Six guy did it. They yeah. told me I couldn't do it. I never gave up. At times, you know, like you lose faith in yourself, but my actions never, like, I may have had mental problems at some point, like, not trying to, like, fight back, but I never stopped the grind. I never stopped the diet. I never fully gave up. And no matter how down you get, do not ever stop everything. Just keep going. Yes. Keep going. Agreed. Absolutely. Now, I want to ask you, are there any people that you want to thank, your coach, any shout-outs you want to give after that? So, obviously, my coach... Without him, Justin Compton, none of this is possible. I want to thank Jonathan Weiss. He owns a gym, Full Throttle Fitness, Full Throttle Fitness in Columbus. Helps me out a lot, posing, everything. I want to thank Mark Knight, who's a good friend of mine, who's another pro. He's a classic pro. Every time I get down and start doubting myself, he picks me up. He believes in me more than I believe in myself. I want to thank Daryl Mayo for helping me get my posing routine down. I'm not the best poser, I will admit that. But without him, it wouldn't be as good as where yeah. it was. But you know, nerves get there, but I am getting better. I am learning. And uh, right now, there's a few people, you know, I want to thank my close friends from back in Cleveland that held me together this whole prep. I had to deal with a lot of personal stuff. Yeah. The fact that I made it to the show is, like, that's another story. That's, it, it's a miracle in itself. Yeah. And you know, I had the right people around me this time to pick me up and be like, get this show, Brian. Don't walk out, get it. and. Um, I'm here and, you're here. and I got that trophy yeah. and everything worked out. Yeah. So, yeah. you know, yeah. not only when the body team. hurts, yeah. when the, you know, when life hits you in the face, yeah. I, I don't want to finish. And my friend's like, no, you're, you're doing this damn show. Yeah. So well, that's so awesome to hear. You have a solid team. I can't wait to see you at the Olympia. Like it's, it's such a cool experience and I can't wait for you to, you know, have that experience he was this the year. Best of the best. Absolutely. Derek, I'm coming for you. Oh. <laughs> Well, thank you for joining us. Stephanie Gibson again at the uh, Indie Pro NPC News Online. See you guys.